With only 11 episodes left of Power Rangers Dino Fury and the 30th anniversary coming next year, a lot of the fans are speculating on what we could possibly get when it looks like a show next season. So th there are a lot of videos that we have made about this topic, but I wanted to make a video that kind of puts all of the facts and all the fan theories all in one place on what is going on what we could see happening and moving forward okay there have been rumors saying that this 30th anniversary could wrap up the series of power rangers and anything after this will be an all new original storyline we don't know if that's true or not we also know that there are a bunch of rumors that david yost is coming back and Hasbro could be hinting at this already with they've got a lightning collection blue blue ranger helmet and power lance coming I thought that was pretty cool it's almost like they're segueing like we got Lord Zed coming back and now here's a Lord Zed helmet out right now Amy Jo Johnson did say that she's not doing it JDF said that he's not doing it now, ASJ, we don't know how that's going to work. Now, he's doing Comic-Cons right now. I don't know how everything will work with it with the legal battle. But he's, like, maybe he could still return. But it's looking like David Yost is for sure coming back as of right now. He's in Ranger shape. He, he's been working out. He's getting swole. I wonder why he's an actor. And that's what they do sometimes. You got to get swole real fast for a role Will this be the grand finale, and could it be a massive team-up? That is a huge question that I think we've all been asking. Even if we don't get the Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, could we get a bunch of Zords, a bunch of weapons, a bunch of side characters to return? It would be fun kind of doing ode to 30 years and kind of climax this out and have this just be a giant battle and something the fans really wanted something that you know i didn't feel like the legendary battle in mega force was that bad but it wasn't as good as even i expected i remember not watching power rangers for years and turn that on just because i knew what it was like and i watched a few episodes of mega force to kind of prime myself for it but that really let me down as what it could have been when they had all those rangers and oh man it, just a few small details and things would have just made that so much better but it is what it is you learn from those experiences the other question that we have no idea on is what season in the sentai will they use will they adapt for power rangers or will this be an all new original suit design that's a big question there are so many talks that that they could be zenkaiger um i i don't know about don brothers um i i know a, a lot of the, the the fans out there want zoo Oger. i think that would be fun um what do you guys think if they do adapt a sentai season what do you think they're going to adapt but then we know that there was a casting call what a couple months ago and they were looking for actors for a six week project in New Zealand. Now, normally when they're shooting like a full season of Power Rangers, this is like a nine to 12 month project, not no six to eight weeks or whatever they said it was. It was very short, meaning that like, they're probably going to be working every single day, but they're only going to be able to what? For six weeks, what could they do? Like eight to ten episodes? Maybe they can be a little longer, but I think it is going to be hard. Um, what do you guys think? Let me know. The other big question that we keep hearing about this 30th anniversary is that Trini's daughter could be the lead character and she might need the help from some og mighty Morphin power rangers now there's a name in the script of the casting caller uh the the girl it's a female lead her name is yen 
but as we know these names always change so maybe her name is it's not going to be yen but it's still kind of cool that um that you could connect it with trini and that's what everyone's saying we'll see but how cool of a dedication would that be to to the actress that played trini you know it, it would just be awesome um, the future is really bright to be a Power Rangers fan right now. It is a great time to be a Power Rangers fan. I've said this for years, man. Power Rangers is not the biggest brand right now. It's kind of teetering. However, we have a huge opportunity to bring this brand and this name, these toys, this show, movie, everything back into relevance. It's up to the fans and it's also up to the crew and everyone that works on these to do their best job and as as our as fans of this show i try to do my best job in covering this that's why i kind of wanted to make a video to touch on all of the points that i've been hearing because every once in a while i'll make a video about it but there are always new things that i hear so let's put these all in one place what do you guys think is is there going to be a female lead could she be trini's daughter do you think it's going to be a big team up and who do you think realistically is going to come back let me know in the comments thank you guys so much for tuning in but you know what no no, no. we're not done let's go to the let's go to the comments let's go to the comments psych we've got another three four minutes left let's get it so rex said if this is a case i think a giant team up would be a fine way to conclude the franchise in this aspect i mean look at it this way the 30th anniversary can dish out a decent amount of episodes then the final one can include a major team up of all the power rangers in the past if so, they could adapt the Battle Megazord from Gokaiger. Okay, um, but do editing to fit the modern Rangers in so far. Yeah, and I want it to be more than just like the last battle. I want there, to, like the last episode, I want there to be like Rangers throughout the whole season. I want to see a bunch of things, not just one team up in the end. And since it's only six weeks it's gonna have to be something eight to ten episodes we're not gonna see no 44 episodes like we're used to in like two years you know 22 episodes a season i think it could be longer however you're not gonna see 22 episodes no more i think that could get chopped in half easily and maybe i'm wrong but maybe i'm right there um mark fried said i highly doubt the power ranger seasons um will never end with that dino fury just asking that's all thank you i don't know what you're trying to say do you think they're going to bring back Dino Fury? Is that what you're trying to say, homie? Yes, because I, I think the Dino Fury Rangers could come back. And if Lord Zed does not come back in Dino Fury this year, he has to be in the 30th anniversary because the Morphin Masters unleashed the Gold Ranger to stop Lord Zed. So keep your eyes on that, folks. I love that one. Dylan Moore, there has to be a team up because it's the 30th anniversary. And when we see the old villains, it could be the biggest and greatest battle in Power Rangers history. I hope we see every villain that I have said I wanted to see return. Oh, that'd be so cool if they just brought the whole the whole crew back, like all of the main villains. Um, someone said, please, Hasbro, don't end Power Rangers after 30 seasons. Yep, they might just be changing it up, homie. Like, and... I don't know. I would like to see them continue because they're doing a good job. They said some kids programming. I've heard that maybe they want to test out the animation. I don't know what they're going to do, guys. I support them regardless. Maybe it is the time to switch something up, though. Let me know what you think on that topic, too. Matt said Power Rangers will continue. Yes, I, I believe so. Um, Man of the USA said it will be very expensive to pull this off. Hey, it might but let's go big or go home spend spend money to make money baby let's go jose says keep power rangers alive by adapting more sentai seasons okay yeah i i agree i this could be a fun time to be a power rangers fan and we could still adapt or not adapt that's what's kind of cool about this is we could go either way and it could be good is all i'm saying is you could not adapt the fans might be upset for a minute but if you give them something good that's enjoyable by the fandom they're gonna watch it man and they're gonna like it and 
hopefully they can make something that resonates with even more people than just the Power Ranger fans. Then they can build this brand again. That's the whole point. You have to innovate or die at this point. We're just teetering. Why do you think this brand keeps getting sold every, what, 10, 11 years it gets sold? Something like that, correct? It's because... It, it's it's a roller coaster, but it never just keeps going up like a lot of these other big names like your Marvel toys your DC heroes those things are always selling the movies are always selling the figures the pop figures everything Power Rangers is a little weird when it comes to toys and that's why I think you have been seeing less and because it's not as huge of a name as it used to be but there's so many things we can do to keep building and i see hasbro and i love it from the business side i see that they are doing a better job just right off the ripper and they still have not gotten to sink their teeth into this yet because we have not been able to see a movie a real series they're just doing the same kind of neo saban thing right now so the fans don't f fully turn on them they're getting you guys happy but soon they're gonna shake up the world they're gonna shake up everything and there are gonna be changes so don't freak out too much guys it's okay changes for the good sometimes i love you guys let me know what you guys think in the comments and we'll see you next time peace Thanks for watching this video. If you like this content, you know what to do. Hit that like, hit that subscribe button, and hit that notification bell. You can also become a member. Please join the fan club support team right now. We have a Blue Ranger power up and a Gold Ranger power up. This is an awesome way to talk with the fans. Join a fan club official chat group. You can also be featured in our videos. At the end of the videos, I will shout you out. That's if you get the Gold Ranger Power Up membership. Go check it out. Go support the fan club. We love you guys, and thanks for watching. Peace.